Here comes the mess by Marta Amanza Esteva and Silvia Romero Andres. Have you ever wondered how messy a mess can get? Hmm. I'm not talking about getting a little bit dirty here and there. I'm talking about serious, all over the place mess. Uh oh. Meet my brother Rob. He's six months old and can sit by himself. And believe me, he wants to eat. He's been watching all of us eating for months when he was only allowed milk. My mom says it's safe for Rob to start eating the same food we eat. He will explore food and learn to feed himself at his own pace. Rob probably thinks his tummy is as big as a dinosaur's and that all the food will fit in there. I'm sure his stomach is not that big. But anyway, that's not the real trouble. The real issue here is the mess. Oh, the mess! What's a little spill here and there? That's mess for beginners. Let me tell you about Rob's professional level mess. We were having lunch the other day and Rob started throwing spaghetti at the wall. One, two, three handfuls of spaghetti went flying and got stuck. But that wasn't all. He then decided that adding some tomato sauce was a great idea. He threw some of that too. Another day, we were having a snack. Yogurt with strawberries. Mm. Soon, Rob ended up looking like Santa. <laughs> he had a white yogurt beard and red strawberries on top of his head. My mom cooked us some giant pasta one evening. That was cool. It was so cool that Rob decided the pasta was a shaker. He started playing songs while the pasta flew around the room. My dad loves bananas. He eats so many so often that I'm sure he would love to be a monkey. When Rob tries new foods for the first time, his faces are just the funniest. I don't think Rob is a big fan of bananas. That means more for my daddy. Rob has a cup for drinking water. When he's not thirsty, it can be a problem. He loves pretending to be a firefighter with a water hose. That is a really wet kind of mess. You see, eating with Rob can be a bit messy sometimes. That's why he wears a bib when he eats. One day, we forgot to put his bib on for breakfast. We found cereal between his toes, on his ears, and in his nappy. That was not a fun sight. Ugh. Rob doesn't know how to use a spoon yet. He plays with it like a xylophone. He has a go at throwing it and seeing where it lands. It may land on top of the fridge or in the cat's food bowl. You never know. The messiest mess usually happens when Rob has porridge or rice. The tiny bits of food seem to be playing hide and seek and they always end up in weird places. Huh? In mommy's pockets, in daddy's shoes, on my nose. Nowhere is safe when Rob is around and making a mess. Every day, Rob is learning how to eat, what he likes, and what he's not too sure about yet. It's made me realize that eating is hard work. We all have to learn at some point. It's so much fun having Rob eat with us at the table. He might be messy, but I love him so much. My parents say I was messy when I started eating too. But look at me now. I'm a big girl. 
I use my fork and spoon. I eat all sorts of food, and I make almost no mess. Rob just needs time and practice, and we'll enjoy the fun until then. <laughs> the end. Please subscribe. <laughs>